Still on that story, reactions continue to trail the murder of Oluwa Bamishi Ayawale on Lagos BRT. A cro cross section of Lagos residents have called on the government to install CCTV cameras on all BRT vehicles for effective monitoring of activities of the drivers and passengers while in transit. Our correspondent, Lavi Kukwe reports. The news has been shocking, especially to commuters who use the BRT on a daily basis. The BRT is regarded as a safe mode of transport since the scheme is run by private investors, but with the supervision of the state government. The brutal murder of Ulua Bamishi and alleged involvement of our BRT driver, Nice Andrew, to her death, may have put a crack on the trust and confidence on the BRT. The life is gone. Must we die first before we begin to react? Why are we not proactive? Why are we not considering actions and activities that will protect the greatest assets of man, which is life? Why? Do you know the generations that have been wiped out by just that one lady? Do you know the trauma that has been set into place? It's pity. It's a pity. Lagosians call for heightened security on the buses. They can implant a camera or whatever, monitoring. And those staffs should have adequate data. I think they can do eye, eye photograph, I mean, to cover their eyelid, their fingerprints, and some other things in order to get those staffs secure. See, there was a camera in that vehicle. I don't know how far it is true. If there's a camera, well, they have tried for that one. But can they produce the camera? I don't know. But if they can still do. Concerning this issue, elders, people that are adults, people, our old age, in other countries, they don't, they don't retire them. We believe that old age, you people old age, they can, they can give them, a, I mean, power. So be, to be monitoring us, such things, because I believe that they will not deceive the nation. We need to sensitize the people. You, you, you know you talked about the young lady crying for help and nobody responded. Let me ask a question. How many times have you seen maybe the institute, no, no, the federal government arm of disaster management coming out to say everybody in Obalende today will want to fake a bus that is on fire? fake the bus on fire, do a drill, and see how people jump from their Okada, jump from their private car, and respond to rescue. Despite fears resulting from Bamiche's death, Lagosians still believe the BRT system is the most comfortable and reliable mode of transportation in Lagos State. From Lagos, Love Ikuku Oyedoku, Plus TV News. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.